Hey Keith, how are you? It's Leo here uh, from Rona Marketing. We spoke earlier. I uh, just wanted to say thank you for being so polite and awesome over the phone today. Uh, the world could definitely use a lot more positive people in it. Uh, so I wanted to shoot this quick video showing you some tips and tricks that you can do in-house to help bring in more business using your website and your Google business profile. Uh, and I'd love to hear some feedback from you. You can respond back to the email if you get a second. And I hope these strategies are helpful. Uh, as you can see right here, uh, this is your site. And uh, it's, it's a nice, decent little site, man. It's uh, the bright colors I like. It gives you that more happy, positive feeling. Um, but it's definitely lacking content on here. It's more like a landing page. Um, Google loves to see content. That's 1,500 to 2,000 words of command content on your home page. And throughout that content, you want to add buyer intent keywords that you want to be found for in Google searches, where you're located, and then the services that you offer. Uh, another good thing that you can do in-house is the way these photos are saved. Um, photos, videos, things like that are key, are, can be used as keywords. They're considered keywords if you're hiding these photos. See, these photos is saved as some uh, the height and the width right there, but you could change that name to roofing services, Lexington, Kentucky, and that'll definitely count as a buyer intent keyword. You can do roof replacement, Lexington, Kentucky on this photo. Um, and that'll help you get more points with Google. Uh, I do like that you've got book appointment up here at top. Um, I like to see this call button, a call to action. That way they could click right here and just give a phone call if they need it to, but definitely having this appointment option up here is awesome. Now, what I've done, Keith, is I put your website in a tool called AREFs, and it's going to give me your analytics and where you're setting. So right here is your UR and your DR. That is the strength and the trust of your website. And this is out of 100, and you want to keep those balanced and moving up continuously. So as of right now, you've got seven backlinks and four referring domains. So implementing some of these tips will help you boost those numbers as well. And if you're unfamiliar with the backlink, it's just a website linking to another website via clickable button or text. But not all backlinks are created equal. There are some that are more spammy and some that's more authoritative. So you really want to go after the backlinks that's more authoritative and relevant to the industry and that's local to you. As of right now, you're just being found for one organic keyword. Um, and it's not bringing you any traffic. So it's just kind of like your website's a digital business card. Uh, Reliable Roofing, Lexington, Kentucky, and Home Services of Kentucky. Uh, you're actually up seven positions to 51. So you was 58. Now you're up to 51 on that. Uh, and again, the buyer intent keyword, you know, is like roof replacement, Lexington, Kentucky, roof repair, Lexington, Kentucky, re-roof, Lexington, Kentucky, things like that. Uh, those are considered buyer intent keywords. Um, so those are the words that you're indexing for. Uh, and you really want to go after strong buyer intent keywords. So let me take you here. Uh, what I searched for you is roofers, Lexington, Kentucky. That is a buyer intent keyword because usually if people types this phrase, they're looking for some work to be done. Now up here is usually where the local ads are. They sit right at the top. Uh, and that's a great way to get business quickly, but down here you have your local maps and you're not in these top three uh, and that's just fine because there are several ways you can get there. Uh, you want to make sure that you're constantly adding reviews. Uh, make sure your business name, address, phone number are the exact same all across the internet. Uh, you don't want to mislead Google. There's also a 750 character about us section at the bottom that you should fill out and add, uh, don't forget to add the buyer intent keywords there as well. Uh, by posting branded, geo-tagged, and geo-located photos weekly uh, really helps you rank organically, and that's just saving those photos with buyer intent keywords. Uh, also, to help out in this section, add in citations, which is your business name, address, and phone number, and things like Yellow Pages, Yex, and Yelp uh, will help you out as well, because at the end of the day, I hate to say it, but Google's like a big popularity contest and giving out your information to as many people as possible, it will make Google start to trust you more uh, with you being indexed in those directories. It'll help boost your business. Now, not only in your area, but that will help boost your business in the surrounding areas as well. 
then in the Google Map Pack gives you about 30 to 40% of the traffic that goes straight to your website. Now, what I've done is now I went down here to the organic section. Um, and bone dry roofers are the number one uh, in the organic. And as you can see here, there's they don't have a lot of content either. So implementing having more content on your site, more than theirs, you can outrank them while adding those backlinks and things as well. Now, I wanted to show you a couple keywords in here that's being found for in Lexington. So roofing companies, Lexington, Kentucky is 800 volume. It's a keyword difficulty of six, and that's getting 800 searches a month. So having this throughout your content, you'll start grabbing a portion of this volume. Uh, roofer, that's uh, South Carolina. Uh, let's see, Lexington Roofing, that's 300. Roofers, Lexington, Kentucky, that's another 300. So there's a decent amount of volume here. So once you start ranking, then like I said, a percentage of that volume will go to you uh, and your site. Uh, and then a percentage of those people is going to give you a call. Depending on your close rate, they turn into a customer. Keith, I really appreciate your time today um, and taking, uh, taking the call and also watching the video. Totally understand you're a one-man wrecking crew. Uh, if this is something you're not interested in, man, I would love, uh, if you had anybody you could refer it out to, I could contact them or you could show them this video, show them what I do. Uh, I'd love to hear back from you, man. I hope this video was helpful. If you got any questions, comments, or concerns, I can be a resource for you. You can email me, call me any time of day, uh, and I'll answer any question you have. Again, my name is Leo Arona from Arona Marketing. Hope you have a great day.